Hey guys, today we changed a little bit our setup. I don't know if you noticed that. What do you think? I hope you like it. Welcome back to the John's Kitchen. My name is Erica. On this channel, we're making beautiful dishes from around the world and making it easier for you to reproduce them at home. If this sounds good, then you might want to subscribe and click the bell notification so you will know every time we upload a new video. Today, we're making the best no-bake chocolate tart. You will love it. It's so silky and tasty. Without any further ado, let's get into it. As a first step, crush your digestive biscuit. Then put them inside a bowl, add the butter. Mix very well until your biscuits have a wet sand consistency. Finally, place your mix inside the tin. With the back of the spoon, press your biscuit and create the shell of your tart. When you're happy with your shape, put it inside the fridge to rest for 20 minutes. Melt some dark chocolate inside your microwave Make sure you keep stirring. At this point, add your butter and keep mixing. At this point, add the coconut cream that you scooped from a can. Keep mixing your ganache. And finally, add your sugar and a pinch of salt. You want to stir this ganache until everything is completely melted. After 20 minutes, take the tart shell from the fridge and pour inside your ganache, make sure that it has cooled down. Tap the tin on the countertop in order to let out any air bubble. If you have any leftover ganache, we created a little treat for your kids. Place some ganache on the top of your biscuit, spread the chocolate with an offset spatula, and then sprinkles everywhere. Look at these beautiful chocolate biscuits. Are these not the cutest things you've ever seen? You and your family will absolutely love them. Remove your tart from the fridge. As you can see, we use a blowtorch, but I know that lots of you will not have it, so a quick trick to remove it easily from your tin will be place your tin in a preheated oven so it will be easier to remove your cake from the tin. And this also will give that nice shine on the top of the tart. Place your gorgeous chocolate tart onto a plate and sprinkle on the top the toppings that you would like. We chose some dry coconut, but use whatever you fancy. Now use a warm knife to cut into your tart and make sure you clean it before you cut the second time. And that's it guys, super easy. We hope you enjoy this beautiful decadent vegan tart. Thank you all for watching this video and staying with us until the end. If you like this video, make sure to smash that like button. For more easy on cooking recipes, have a look at our previous videos. That's it for me. I'll see you here very soon. Ciao ciao! What do you think? What do you think? I hope you will like it. <laughs> I hope you like it. Cut. <laughs>